Oh, oh, oh. That's a lot of rats. That's a lot of rats! We're in the lower city! My daughter Vanra! My little girl! She's missing! Oh no! This stupid, useless fist said she had a lead, but she must have been stuck in <laughs> dream mist or something! Madam, tell me. You said. She was. Is she alright? Taken from a tavern? Are you a true yes. soul? The blushing Aww. mermaid down by the docks, I told you a hundred times. Why aren't you listening? You look like coming back! I'll help you find your daughter. You will? Thank you. Her name is Vanra. She's seven years old. And has red hair. Like me. We were in the Blushing Mermaid when she was taken. I should have saved her. Let's talk to Nazora. Here she comes. Oh my god. Sorore Surge. Hello. Come, sisters, be my testament. No tomb sit in Beator. No tomb sit in Beator. You've heard of such devils, sisters of justice, adjudicators of diabolical contracts and bargains. Holy hells. Where is my father? How do I save him? How else we bargain, sisters? Infernos contractos te vocamos. Infernos contractos te vocamos. Infernos contractos te vocamos. Your contract will, signed in blood, Forged in fire, bound in bone, but not unbreakable. Then break it already. No contract is ended without sacrifice. A cost must be paid. Didn't I already free you? Will Ravenguard, a choice is before you. Option one. I show you the way to your father. I guarantee him no harm except that from you and your allies. And you pledge your soul to me and the Archdevil Zariel in a pact eternal. Option two. I break your pact and you are freed from your duty. Your father dies by his enemy's hand and Baldur's Gate loses its greatest champion. Name your sacrifice. Bloody Zariel. I won't let her take Will. Silence, Karlak. Mizora, you asshole. Choose. You deserve your freedom, Will. You damned wretch. Father. Do it. Break the pact. Fiat Ita. Fiat Ita. Anima ad beator. That was quick. Didn't think you had it in you. <laughs> Seems my boy's all grown up. And don't go fussing about your father. You made your choice. You knew the terms. You know what? I think I'll stick around. Not for the greater good, you understand. Just for the entertainment. Oh, he's free. Will. Gods, I spent seven years choked by Mazora's leash. And I spent seven years hoping to break free. 
I never knew freedom could taste so bittersweet. You're your own man now, I have to believe that. I'm not the Hell's puppet in life, nor its warrior in death. The Blade will be guiding his own hand. But freedom will be paid in my father's blood. Tomorrow, I celebrate my gain. Today, I mourn my loss. That's crazy, you just passes. stuck like that now. In the stillness, you find a moat of tranquility. The Raven God name now lives solely with me. I, can't I will make it count for something. I can't something. believe he's just stuck looking like this now, that sucks. Yeah, he's not dead yet. I signed his life away before the Hell's Witnesses. It would be easier to drink the sticks down to the last drop than to alter his fate. I'd be a fool to wish otherwise. Little Will's all grown up. God. I can't wait Her to design. see what trouble he gets into. You forced Will to make an impossible choice. Impossible? My bargain was uncommonly reasonable. A single soul for the return of Baldur's Gate's most beloved duke. A real bargain, I should think. I never thought the legendary Blade of Frontiers would surrender his father for freedom. Not very valorous, if you ask me. But what does a mean old devil like me know about heroes? You've left Karlak alone? Oh, oh, if Will isn't your warlock, why stick around? The Absolutists worked a number on me at Moonrise. And you're the best hope I've got at payback. No one crosses the Hell's children without getting scorched. Fair enough. I can still feel the shadow fell all over me. Still hear her words in my ear. I feel... unclean. I'm sorry. You've nothing to be sorry for. Far from it, in fact. Without your help, things could have ended very differently for me. I have an idea. Something I've wanted to do for a while. Something that might help me put her in the past. But I'll need your help. Alright. Wait until the others are asleep. Then come with me. There's a place we can go. Oh. Down the coast a little. This will do. Take off your clothes. Oh, it's one of these scenes. Uh oh. All right. Gonna have to cut this. Oh, you. I thought I asked you to clean the rats out of the cellar yesterday already. Hop to it. Get in there. The rats are unimportant. Your name is on a list of murder targets. No, I need them rats taken care of. Here's the deal. I'll keep a lookout for murderers. You murder the rats. Sure. Oh, oh, oh. That's a lot of rat. That's a lot of rats! What the heck? All right, Gail. I guess. Fireball. Yeah, fireball seems about right. There you go. And then we can shoot another rat. Blackhead has found us. Get rid of them quickly. No, I'll get rid of them, all right. What a pleasant surprise. Here you are, as brazen as described. The gloom soul who thieved from our queen. Of course you had help, didn't you? From the elithid you carry inside the astral prism. Their noses are so gross. That we should meet here, in the very place that it once called home. We know all about the Emperor and its dealings with you. Your story ends here. We will reclaim the Astral Prism, purge it of the Elithid Interloper, and restore it to our Queen. You can certainly die trying. Death will be yours, and yours alone, Gake Slave. Hataka! Alright. 
You guys don't see me? I'm surprised they weren't all looking at me. There we go. And then we don't have much else we can do. Yep. And we're gonna do that one more time. Here we go. Yep. And throw the... Cast the weapon. Counter spell that, Gale. That's still hit, though. Shoot her again. Right? That's good, right? Alright. Three. That's 30% chance to hit. Who cares? Of course. She's dead. He's dead. Uh, no, you're not gonna do that. Is she gonna jump? Oh, no, counter that. Summon someone else! Oh, now he can do stuff. Yeah, let's multi-attack. Mess him up. <laughs> yeah, you, you need to go, sir. Alright. Ow! Mess him up again. Go. Is relentless. You that well. Who's this? It's not safe here. It's too late for me, but not for you. What's going on? Run as fast as your legs can carry you. Lazel, you heard what happened. Or in heaven. She sees me from our camp. Bore me here to Baal's enclave. When? What? She, she slit my belly and filled her cup with my blood. A toast, she said, to her false god. <laughs> that scared the crap she out of me. I was like, what's Lazel doing here? She'd come for the rest of me. I'm done for. I will hold her off as long as I'm able. Run while you still can. Don't even think about fighting her. This foe is too powerful. Your sacrifice is a no You're coming with us. You let the Githyanki weigh you down. She would make corpses of you all. Look at it. Crawling. And sniffing and rooting around. Why do you keep things? showing up, Lauren? I'm not even here Is for you right yet. The stone you see. I'm not here for you Ooh, yet. Piggy. <gasps> hush, hush. Orin will take care of you and your little pet. What have you done with Lazel? Nothing. No, not a thing. <laughs> Still gasping and gagging on the foul airs of Baal's temple. <laughs> I will not slice. Her kind die too easily. The murder lord demands a better offering. Something new. Sticky, sweet, and delicious. He wants you. I'm afraid I'll have to wait his turn. The murder lord does not need permission to kill you. 
For a dull, a blunt blade unfit to flay. Oh, boy. But you could be sharpened, thin and jagged. Yes, yeah, she's I crazy, will tell dude. you what to do. Against the tyrant's throat, of course. You've heard Gortash's whispers. I see how your skull swarms with his promises. He whinges and wails over the crown of Carsus, wanting to command it without me. Oh, how I long to slit his poxy smile from ear to ear. But I can't touch him. He bound my blade when we first conspired. Cortash didn't want me at first. Didn't trust me. Got me to wag my tongue, swear an oath never to hang him from the hooks. Trip drain him into father's open jaws. You must kill the tyrant. Take the netherstone from his corpse and bring it to my <laughs> They temple. really think I'm gonna work with either of them? Nah. No. Nope. We slice and shred each other. The survivor claims the stones. What's left of the other is balls. Agree, and I will bring my assassins to heal. They watch you always. I like fighting them, Orin. Longing to spray the crimson from your veins. Orin, no, I like killing them. Refuse me, and you'll learn what happens to those who defy Baal's doctrine. So will your friend. Orin demands a fight to the death. The prize for the victor, the Nether Stones, and the chance to control the crown alone. I don't trust Except Orin. And you must kill Gortash. Refuse, and your companion's life may be forfeit, as might your own. Orin's assassins will hunt you like prey for slaughter. Oh, God. <sighs> the promise of slaughter? <laughs> Of pain and humiliation, and the sound of blood drip dropping into the gutter. Do not underestimate his steel watch. Seek their cradle in the lower city, and skewer their skull meat. Make them rust and blood. Then you can gore the lordling again and again and again. Listen close, bone killer. Step in my domain while the tyrant still sucks air, and I will carve your failure into your pretty plaything's skull. <laughs> Bring me his stone, and I will set the bait free. <laughs> Only then can you and I make exquisite butchery. The victor. Will set the world so I to can't, slaughter. So I can't use Lazel for a while, huh? That is Baal's offer. That is crazy. He will not make another. Hmm? Oh my god. Why am I heavily encumbered? 